हॅलो एव्हरी वन आय एम सुप्रिया रासकर असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर इन डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इंजिनिअरिंग सायन्सेस ए आय एस एस एम एस आय ओ आय टी पुणे टुडे वी विल सी द टॉपिक टाईप्स ऑफ मॅट्रायसेस सो फर्स्ट टाईप इज रो ऑर कॉलम मॅट्रायसेस फर्स्ट वी विल सी रो मॅट्रायसेस देन वी विल सी कॉलम मॅट्रायसेस तर रो मॅट्रायसेस इज अ मॅट्रिक्स ऑफ ऑर्डर वन क्रॉस एन दॅट इज हॅविंग ओनली वन रो and n number of columns is known as row matrix or row vector an example of row matrix a is a matrix a11 is the first element of matrix a12 is the second and so on a1n is the last element of that matrix means this matrix has n number of columns and only one row means this matrix is said to be row matrix and their order is 1 cross n next example is b matrix b matrix has elements minus uh, 1 minus 2 1 0 3 means this matrix has four columns and only one row means this matrix has order is 1 cross 4 this is the example of row matrix next type is a column matrices column matrices means a matrix of order m cross 1 that is having only one column and m rows is known as column matrix or column vector an example of column matrix r a is equal to a has the element a11 a21 a31 and so on means this matrix has order m number of rows and only one column means this matrix has order m cross 1 next example is matrix b b matrix b has elements are 1 0 2 means this matrix has three number of rows and only one column means this matrix b has order is 3 cross 1 this is the example of column matrix next example zero or null matrix a matrix containing all zero element is known as zero or null matrix and it is denoted by z Z is an example of zero or null matrix. This matrix has all elements are zero. This matrix is said to be zero matrix or null matrix. Next type is a square matrix. Square matrix means a matrix containing number of rows is equal to number of column is known as square matrix. An example of square matrix is first one is A matrix A. A matrix has three number of rows. and also three number of column means this is a 3 cross 3 matrix matrix a has order is 3 cross 3 means this is a square matrix next example is matrix b matrix b has order 2 cross 2 means two number of rows and two number of columns means this matrix has order is 2 cross 2 means if matrix has order n cross n then this matrix is said to be square matrix next fourth one is a transpose of matrix transpose of matrix means a matrix obtained by interchanging row and column of a matrix a is called transpose of a and it is denoted by a dash or a star or a transpose an example of transpose matrix a is here transpose matrix means interchange of row and column if matrix has first row is 1 2 3 matrix a has first row is 1 2 3 then their transpose has first column is 1 2 3 means only interchange row to column matrix a has second row is 2 1 4 then their transpose has second column is 2 1 4 next matrix a has third row is 0 1 2 then their transpose has third column is 0 1 2 next matrix a has fourth row is 1 1 minus 1 and their transpose has fourth column is 1 1 minus 1 means a matrix has transpose is a transpose if matrix a has order is 4 cross 3 then their transpose has order is 3 cross 4 means we have to interchange row to column this is this, are, this is the example of transpose matrix next fifth one is symmetric matrix symmetric matrix means a square matrix a is said to be symmetric if a is equal to a transpose means a matrix and their transpose is equal to same matrix a matrix and their transpose are same then this matrix is said to be symmetric matrix 
that is in a symmetric matrix a i j is equal to a j i for all i and j a i j is equal to a j i means if matrix uh, has a three one element it if matrix a has a three one element then their a transpose has a one three element means a three one and a one three are same then matrix is said to be symmetric matrix an example of symmetric matrix here first row of matrix a r 1 2 minus 1 then their first column is also 1 2 minus 1 second row of matrix a is 2 1 3 then their second column is also 2 1 3 third row of this matrix is minus 1 3 2 then their third column is also minus 1 3 2 means here if matrix has a 2 1 a 2 1 element is 2 81 position of element is 2 then their a 1 2 position of element is also 2 so this is the example of symmetric matrix 6 1 is skew symmetric matrix skew symmetric matrix means a is said to be skew symmetric if a is equal to minus a transpose here a i j is equal to minus a j for all i and j and diagonal elements of skew symmetric matrix are zero because a i i is equal to minus a i i and a i i plus a i i is equal to 2 a i i and 2 a i is equal to zero means a i is equal to zero means all diagonal elements a 1 1 0 a 2 2 0 a 3 3 0 and so on if matrix has order n cross n then their a 1 1 a 2 2 a 3 3 and so on a r n n All these elements are zero. Means diagonal elements are zero. Symmetric matrix diagonal elements are zero. An example of skew symmetric matrix is A is equal to here in this matrix A diagonal elements all are zero, 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 and non-diagonal elements are if matrix has first row is 0 1 2 then their first column is minus of first row means matrix a has first row is 0 1 2 then their first column is 0 minus 1 minus 2 second row of matrix a is minus 1 0 3 then their second column is 1 0 minus 3 means we have to interchange first row to minus of first column next we have to interchange second row to minus of second column Means we have to interchange row to minus of column. This matrix is said to be symmetric matrix. Seventh diagonal matrix. Diagonal matrix means if a square matrix contains all non-diagonal elements are zero, then it is called as diagonal matrix. Example is a matrix. There only diagonal elements are present one, two, three, and non-diagonal elements are zero. This is the example of diagonal matrix. Next one is a scalar matrix. Scalar matrix means if a square matrix contains all diagonal elements equal and all non-diagonal elements are zeros, then it is called as scalar matrix. Here only diagonal elements are same, two, 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 and non-diagonal elements are zero. Then this and matrix is said to be scalar matrix. Ninth one is unit matrix. Unit matrix means it is a diagonal matrix where all the diagonal elements are unity, and it is denoted by I n. Unit matrix is also called as identity matrix. Identity we know that identity matrix only diagonal elements are one and non-diagonal elements are zero. Then the and we have to this matrix is square matrix then this matrix is said to be identity matrix 10th one is a upper triangular matrix upper triangular matrix means it is a square matrix in which all the elements below the principal diagonal are zero here principal diagonal elements are 1 2 1 and below principal diagonal elements are zero then this type of matrix is said to be upper triangular matrix next lower triangular matrix lower triangular matrix means it is a square matrix in which all the elements above principal diagonal are zero an example of lower lower triangular matrix is matrix a is 
मैट्रिक्स ए हैज प्रिंसिपल डायगोनल एलिमेंट्स आर थ्री टू वन एंड अब प्रिंसिपल डायगोनल एलिमेंट्स ऑल आर जीरो देन दिस टाइप ऑफ मैट्रिक्स इज सेड टू बी लोअर ट्रैंगुलर मैट्रिक्स दीज आर दी टाइप्स ऑफ मैट्रिक्स एंड थैंक यू